I am back with another video for you guys. It's been a long time since I've done a DIY. I'm sorry, but I am back and I'm excited. <laughs> so this week's DIY is super, super fun and super trendy if I do say so myself. So if you guys are really in touch with the whole fashion world, if you guys are into the trends and stuff, you would totally know that pins and patches are 100% in and I am stoked. I am so excited. I love the trend. I think it's so fun. But the problem is I am not willing to commit to ironing a patch on my jacket and having it there for life. So because of my little commitment issues, I was inspired to make today's DIY. So today's video is DIY temporary patches slash pins and yeah. So let's just jump right into today's video. To start off this DIY, all you want to do is grab a pen and roughly sketch out your patch design. Obviously, you can find anything off the internet and print that out as well, but I didn't have a printer at the time. So once you are done sketching it out or printing out your design, go ahead and cut out your design. Once you're done that, you can go ahead and grab your felt and grab a pin and pin down your cutout onto some felt. Once you're done that, you can go ahead and grab your scissors and start cutting away. Once you've cut the first layer off, you can go ahead and repeat the exact same steps. So I'm just cutting my smiley little cutout there to make it smaller and I'm just going to pin that onto some yellow felt and start cutting away like I did earlier. And now I have two circles. I've got a black one and a yellow one. So the black one's essentially kind of like an outline because I want it to look very cartoony and very patch-like and I feel like the outline adds that nice little patch touch and cartoony touch. Anyways, all you want to do is glue the yellow part of the smiley onto the black part and grab a needle and thread and do the most basic stitching out there. <laughs> so all I'm doing is weaving in and out of the black and yellow felt I'm so sorry it's out of focus, but I promise you this part is super easy. Of course, you do not have to stitch if you don't want to. You can just glue everything down, but I think it adds a nice um, patch-like effect. So now I've cut out all the details. I've got the eyes and the smile, and I'm just gluing that down with some hot glue. Once you're done that, you're just going to need a pin, um, a safety pin to be exact, and a small rectangular piece of fabric. I'm just using black felt again, and all I'm doing now is gluing the felt piece down. You are not gluing the safety pin. You are gluing the felt down on top of the safety pin so that the safety pin can move freely still. And here you are. You've got yourself a nice little pin patch thingy mabobber. <laughs> I definitely loved how they turned out. I think they're so, so, so cute. Super inexpensive and just so fun and so easy to personalize. And the best part is it's temporary. Yes, girl, if you have commitment issues, I got you. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed today's DIY. Give me a thumbs up if you do and leave a comment down below which pin or slash patch was your favorite. I really like the smiley. I think it's super cute. At first, I thought it kind of looked kind of like um, the Walmart rollback smiley and I was like eh. but now I'm feeling it I think it's cute <laughs> but yeah I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and I will see you next week bye don't stop, get, get it. Get, get, don't stop, get, get it.